This video is about adding a telltale to an old OMC outboard, or I guess really any other outboard that does not have one. And on these old OMCs, uh, you have a couple locations you can choose from, but I choose right here. This is a 1970 Evinrude Big Twin 40 horsepower, and I choose to drill the hole right here. Um, you Ideally, you should take off the head so you don't get any shavings inside. Um, I have not in, inside the water jacket. I have not done that. I just keep some heavy marine grease um, on the hole as I'm drilling. When I get down close, get some more grease, clean it all out. You can see down in that hole maybe. Um, didn't really get anything inside. So I'm getting ready uh, to use the uh, tap and die here. And I'm gonna go ahead and thread this out. I've checked this on a piece of aluminum uh, with the fitting that I'm going to be using. This is actually off of another one that I'd already done this on, so this fitting's been in use for years. I'm just moving it over to this motor from my parts motor. Um, but I will be putting this in. I double-checked everything on a piece of aluminum that I had laying around the garage because you really don't want to make a mistake. Um, fortunately, I do have a spare head if something were to go wrong, um, but I really don't want to mess this up. So I'm going to go ahead and tap this out and then come back. Okay, you can see that I have tapped out the water jacket right here. I've got it zoomed in and I just barely threaded that in there just to check the fitment. You can see I've actually got it a little bit crooked. That really doesn't matter in the grand scheme of things. You just want this to fit in here snugly. You have to be very careful anytime you're working with this very soft and old aluminum. Um, it's just you got to go very slowly and, and don't put a lot of torque on it. The um, I will put some Teflon probably on those threads so that it doesn't leak and then I'll just snug it up and then route it down around here and then when we put the cowling on we'll show you a picture of that. So. So it looks like we have success. You can see the water is pumping out um, of the tube and down to the hole in the cowling. I will add probably a, an elbow to shoot that out to the side so that when I'm on the boat from the driver's seat, I can look out and see the stream. That's important because you can see that water that is spritzing out um, to the hole on the left. That is the exhaust relief port or something like that. And that doesn't always happen on plane. And that's why I like to add a telltale so I can always tell that it's pumping water. Thanks much.